Hello, everybody, and welcome to Markiplier Saves Christmas. <laughs> I am the Seventh Sword, and this is a fan made game made by somebody named Random Ryan. Now, I don't know Random Ryan in person, but I did get to talking to him on the YouTube. Uh, I was watching Markiplier video, and he had mentioned that he had made a fan made game for Markiplier recently, and I asked him if I could check it out and possibly play it for my channel, and he agreed, so here I am playing this game. Now, Markiplier is not the only reason why I decided to start a YouTube. However, back in the day when I'd watch Red vs. Blue, I'd sit there and be like, I wish I could do that. And then I'd watch, like, Tobuscus, for example, or whatever, and go, man, I really wish that I could be doing that. And then I watched Markiplier's videos, and for some reason, after watching his videos, I said, you know what, I'm going to do that. So, Markiplier, your videos ignited the spark that allowed me to, t to like, blaze down this YouTube path. So, I want to thank you very much for that. And this video is going to be my tribute not only to you, Markiplier, but to all of your fans, as well as to Random Ryan. So I want to thank everybody, and I want to thank you, Markiplier. I highly doubt you're ever going to see this video, but thank you very much. You've inspired millions of people to do some amazing things with their lives, and that is no small feat. So you keep doing what you're doing, sir. It is working. Now, let's get into it. New game. For an optimal experience, please refrain from playing this game in full screen mode. I am currently playing the game in windowed mode, so we are all good. Thank you, game. Would you like to see the opening sequence slash scene? I added sequence. I thought it's, I thought sequence was a cool word. All right, yes, of course. We need to know how this thing starts. Our story begins with a letter sent to a YouTuber known as Markiplier. The one sending the letter did not reveal themselves. The letter seemed suspicious as a result. Come to Hadara Town. The people there need you. That was all that was written in the letter. Rather than discard the note like anyone else, Markiplier responded with a hell yeah! I know I didn't finish it. It was fast. I apologize. <laughs> is, that his, is that his mode of transportation? With the help of his trusty spaceship, the Crashy McSplody, Mark set out and traveled to Hadara Town. What he would see there would soon surprise him. Ooh, it looks nice. Hadara Town. Well, look. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. <clears throat> well, this looks like the place. Small and snowing. Still, why was I led here? Current objective. Look for whoever guided you here. Look for this character. All right, let's go. Can I run? Can I run? Yeah. Ooh, menu. I got a menu. Let's see here. Can I talk to townspeople and stuff? Can I talk to you, sir? What do you have to say? This town is close to Santa's workshop. I don't know if that's a good thing or not, but I could be first in line to get presents. But he could also keep a close eye on me, too. Oh, you're right, sir. You are very right. In... You look suspicious, sir! He should be coming soon. That giant orange spaceship heralded his arrival. Ooh, I like the exclamation point. Wait! You're him! Who? Me? Yes, you're the one we sent the letter to. Good to know that it went through after all. Allow me to introduce myself. I am not the developer of this game. You are not the developer of this game. Rather, I was created by the developer as a means to be a guide. I am actually a body double of the developer. A lot like, well, because I don't want to get sued, I'm a body double. Much like how Shansome Jack has one of his own in Schmorderland series. Ah, yes, the, Sh the Schmorderland series. I've played many of them. You know what I'm referring to, right? <laughs> oh, well, either way. It's unfortunate, though. He really wanted to meet you in person, but he couldn't simply because he is way too busy with other things. Hence me taking his place. Anyways, that hardly matters. The reason why you were brought here is because of a predicament taking place at Santa's workshop. Wait, so what's going on there? Well, you see... Actually, this might be better if you hear it from the man himself. Follow me, please. Lead the way, not developer. Lead the way. I like the music, too. It's very upbeat. Very cool. <gasps> that looked like a Final Fantasy character to the left! It did. You can't deny it did. All right, kiddies. Oh my god. Was that Markiplier's voice? Ah, so you're the bastard kiddies! That are going to set everything straight, huh? I, I guess. Fine, then! The thing is, there, there's this really bad person that made his way into my workshop. 
What's worse is he really wants to stab everyone's butts. Oh, he's a butt stabber. Really? That's just awful. I know, that's my shtick. Uh... Wait. I know who you're talking about. You do? Yeah. That has to be the work of the crazed butt stabber. He must have escaped again. Really? The crazed butt stabber is at large again. Then I have to go after him. Because I am Markiplier and I'm so strong and so pro and all of that jazz. Wah. Yeah, yeah. We gotta take care of him. Santa can't have his butt step at all. That would be horrible. We should team up. I'll go on ahead and make sure that he doesn't escape. Also, I'll have to make sure that my booze is still okay. Especially that eggnog. I gotta have my eggnog. <laughs> you know what to do, kitties. We're gonna fly back to the workshop. But, boss. Oh, what is this? What is it this time? There's a really bad blizzard that we had to go through to get here. We almost died coming from the workshop. And we got through it just fine. Sure, it's a bad snowstorm, but you kitties could handle that. You could handle me. You could handle that. Boss, it's too dangerous. You have two options, kitties. Are you going to do as I say and fly through the storm? Or would you rather be in the entertainment room? <laughs> flying. <laughs> They're flying. Well, that was interesting. So that's why people here need me. I'd better go ahead and catch up with Santa. Wait a minute. You're not going like that, are you? What do you mean? You're unarmed. You don't mean to tell me that you're going to go there without any items, weapons, a shield, or armor, are you? Of course! No, you know what? Yes, that was the plan, because I'm so strong. I don't need weapons. You and the developer must have a very strange sense of humor. Well, either way, you should get yourself some weapons, armor, and the like. All right, then, I suppose. Wait! A dear friend of yours came by earlier today. He wanted to know where you were, and since you're here, he should be able to help you in Santa's workshop. Mark, down here! Hmm? Oh, it's Tiny Box Tim! Tiny Box Tim! Oh, my little biscuit, Tim. Markiplier, we meet again at last. Haha, <laughs> victory pose. I'm back and ready to go on another adventure with you. Of course you are, Tim. Tiny Box Tim got the message regarding Hadara Town as well. The real me figured that he should tag along with you since you two are virtually inseparable. That, and it'd be the best to have a friend to tag along with you because A, buddy system, B, extra help to get rid of the crazed butt stabber. Oh, and one last thing. You received 20,000 gold. I wish I could just receive 20,000 gold. Jeez. Now that you have some currency, you should be able to shop for some gear here in town. You should have more than enough to get whatever you'd like now. If I were you, I'd have Tiny Box Tim as your white mage and black mage, while Mark would be the one who does most of the physical fighting. Anyways, come talk to me once you're ready to head out. I'll be waiting here. Thank you, not developer. Current objective, gear up with armor and weapons. All right. Oh, that's my menu. Let's, let's leave the menu. I want to sprint. Hmm. So, are there item shops over here somewhere? I believe there are items. Ooh, armor. I will buy some armor. Hello. If you got any money, I'll give you armor to protect your golden life. Bye. I want, ooh. Whoa, there's a lot of different armors in this game. How long is this game? He said it was like 30 minutes. Why are there so many items? That's awesome though. That is pretty cool. I don't know what to buy. Um, hmm, I suppose for now, I will just buy the, um, I'll buy heavy, I, I can buy, I have $20,000. I'll buy lots of cool stuff. Heavy ice suit. And then I'll also, I'll buy the best in every category. Yes. Yes, give me everything you have. I want the giant shield. Wait, no, is there better shields? Are there better shields? Large ice shield, I'll get the giant shield. And then I'll get the, I'll get the sturdy helmet. And then I'll get the summoner's hat. As well as, um, oh God, I don't even know what to get. Impenetrable bracelets. That works for me. Try not to die. I'll try, I'll try. 
All right, so what else do I need? Weapons? Those are items. Those are items. Hmm. So that means there's gonna be battles in this game? Most of these RPG Maker games, I don't know. Well, the ones that I've seen Markiplier play really haven't had battles, so... This is awesome. Feeling overburdened by money, son? Spend it here. Spend it now. Oh, there are a lot of things. Okay. Ooh, I want the... The beam sword. Ooh, Excalibur. Excalibur, and then I will get to go ahead and get the, uh... The legendary rod. And that'll be good. I think I'm good. Always happy to take your money. I'm sure you are. I should probably go get some potions and items and whatnot. It's very important when you're questing. Especially after a crazed footstepper. Welcome, customer. Potion, ether. Ooh, cool. This is exactly like Final Fantasy, pretty much. Alright, potions. I will buy... I will buy 51 potions. And... And two ethers. And then one elixir. And then we are good to go. Thank you. See you soon. Alright, how long? Okay, I think I'll go for like about like another like... T I don't know, like eight, eight minutes. I'll go with eight minutes. Something like that. Don't quote me though. Please don't quote me. Don't ever quote me. Who are you? Santa Claus sees us when we're sleeping and he knows when we're awake. He also knows if we've been bad or good too. Santa Claus, jolly old elf or CIA spook. I don't know, but come with me. You think you can do some serious damage with some sort of crazy limit break? No? You got the hair for it. All right. Hello, not developer. Yes, you need something? I'm ready. Are you sure? Yes, I am ready. Okay, but before we go, would you like me to explain how the battle in this game works? I'm gonna try to figure it out. This is important, Mark. Are you sure that you don't need my advice? I am super sure. <laughs> Alright, if you say so. Here, I'll restore your HP and MP before we head out. <laughs> Was I damaged? Now then, let's head out. The citizens here really need, or no, really give me the creeps. We'll be able to get to Santa's workshop in no time, with your crashy McSplody. So let's use that, and away we go. Away we go. So far, this game is pretty cool. Ooh, castle. Here we are, Santa's workshop. If the butt stabber is at large here, then I cannot linger. I'll have to save the world from him yet again. Hey. Now that I think of it, yeah, if Santa has magical powers, then how come he hasn't got rid of this so-called crazed butt-stabber? Hmm, I don't know. He's probably too fat and lazy to take care of himself. Yeah, you're probably right. I asked him to watch his weight and exercise last year, and he got mad and threw some pineapples at me. How many? So he threw more than one pineapple at you. Just how many did he throw? I'm not quite sure. It was enough to fill a catapult, which he used to throw them at me. If I were to guess, he had to have used more than 20. Okay, now I'm convinced. My real-world counterpart has a very strange sense of humor. Well, I suppose we should get going. Very well, then. I'll be here in case you ever need to go back to Hadara Town. Oh, and Mark, while you're at it, you ought to make sure that his kitties get fed this month. From what I've heard, Santa hasn't been giving them a lot of food over the years. Wow, Santa Claus is a jerk! The crazed butt-stabber must have gotten another victim! I can't wait any longer. Let's go, Tiny Box Tim! Right behind you, Mark! Current objective. Investigate the situation in Santa's workshop. Woo! Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Ooh, hello there. Hey, can you spare some food, please? I could go for a salmon. I have no salmon for you. Salmon smells. I'll get you something better. East Hall. Back Hall. I'm wondering if there are actually a bunch of, like, random battles, or if it's just, like, one battle versus the crazed Butchdaba. The boss took a watermelon and drilled a hole into it. It was also used in the entertainment room at one time. Why would that be? What is this? A bookshelf. It looks like it's not in bad shape. Hmm. Wait. There's something here. Got a watermelon. Yes. Entertainment room is written on the black. It doesn't appear to be locked, but it won't open. Oh, it won't open, eh? I like the music in here. It's very... Oh, there are random battles. Phantom Ember emerged. Imp Ember emerged. Oh, no. Imp. 
merge. Ah, oh, I see. It's like the, uh, you know, Earthbound battle system. Mark, use uh, attack. Oh, gift box, boom box. I have nothing. I guess I'll just attack. Oh. Yeah. Am I doing good? No damage. I didn't equip them with things, bro. I escaped. I can't escape? No, Mark. Mark, please. No. Didn't I escape? Oh. Mark's party was defeated. No. What happened, Mark? I thought you were so super strong and so pro. Did I have to save? Oh. Well, I'm sorry, everybody. I totally forgot to equip the items, which was stupid of me. Um, and I didn't save. I completely am used to checkpoints. I totally disregarded saving. Too bad I'm not a spastic saver, I guess. Like someone else that I know. All right, well, you know what? I'm gonna cut it here then. Thank you guys so much for watching, and let me know if you want to see a part two of this and see if you want, like, to see where it goes. If not, you guys should still just download and play this game. It seems pretty fun, and <laughs> it's difficult, so don't make the same mistakes I did, but I'll see you guys later.